What's up guys, this is King Mamba here. Um, today in this video I'm basically just showing you guys my settings that I use. Um, some tips that like maybe can improve your accuracy if you do them enough. And um, some things you can do when you're out in the open and someone's behind a wall and they're not coming out and out of cover. So it basically makes it even. Um, before I get started, I just want to say the reason I haven't been posting lately is because I just I haven't really been playing any GTA just been not doing much not even getting online so sorry for that and I'm gonna try and start posting more often like I was before but um without any further ado let's just get started alright so my settings aren't really anything special like usual I play on full play standard FPS these are basically this is what I used to aim with, my dead zone and everything. Um, I don't really change my settings around. Maybe the only thing I really mess with is my aiming sensitivity. I like sometimes I drop it down one or two if I'm filling like micro C's off or I raise it all the way up, but this is how I like it right now. Um So that's basically my settings. Um and also if anybody doesn't know this, um there is one thing where is it at? display you can turn this off turn this off so like if you don't know about this if you turn this off it takes away the blurriness around the characters so it's easier to kill people in my opinion so basically that's my settings and that's what I use so now I'll just show you guys some ways to improve your accuracy alright so when you're in the skills part, like when you're trying to increase your accuracy, what I do is I go into death matches with my friends, like private ones, and I play one bullet rifles and run one bullet pistols. So it's basically where you only fire one bullet, so it increases your accuracy. So this is basically how I improve my accuracy. I just come in games like this, and I just I'll play one bullet rifles. And then the next game I'll play one bullet pistols and just keep rotating them and increases your accuracy. If you keep doing it over time and time again. <laughs> and another thing you can do, like I said, when you're out in the open. Like so if you're out in the open and someone's on a wall, if you're aiming down like this, it automatically flick up to them. I don't do it when I'm on right because it's really cheap. But if you do it when you're on left, it makes it fair so the person on right doesn't kill you alright well those are some of the ways I use to practice my aim and get my accuracy better um since I can't play and talk at the same time it's really difficult to do it's hard to concentrate on the game and talk and keep your train of thought while playing so I'm just gonna end the video here um thanks for watching I'm going to have some clips of just me playing for a little bit of that game. Well, thanks for watching.